Hello, hello, hello. Thank you very much for clicking on this video. This is one of those that I just decided to record it, quickly set everything up. Hopefully everything is going to work. So let's do it. Samsung DeX on Windows and Samsung, hold on, let me shut the door. Samsung DeX on Windows and Samsung DeX on the Mac. And I wanted to test this out and basically show it to you on on the uh, on the video in the in the video. Um, I what do I mean test this out? I already use Samsung Dex for Windows for some time in Office on one of the uh, workstations in Office. We have on Windows 10, and I wanted to demonstrate how Samsung Dex works on Windows or Mac. And, and because I don't have the Windows machine, I needed to find a way to demonstrate this and just play around just to see how it's performing. But I, I wanted to do something different from everyone else on YouTube. If you search for Samsung DeX on Windows or some DeX on a Mac, everybody's demonstrating how the DeX works on like super end gaming PC or high end laptop or super IM Mac Pro that costs five grand and etc. I wanted to do something different. So I got my hands on this bad boy. This is Apple mac mini 2014 version so it's uh six years old ish um it's mac mini it's not really powerful uh from my memory it has i5 processor four gigabytes of ram a built-in video card at 1300 megabytes or 1.3 gigabyte video card and it has 500 gigabytes uh ssd i think it's ssd anyway uh, I got this uh, this device for this video, so let's see how it's performing. I do have the uh, pretty much like I said, everything's connected. I do have a mouse and a keyboard. That's all I need is just start this bad boy. I think it started, but I need to get the a different um, HDMI output. Uh, here we go. Uh, so let's punch in the password. Um, this device was uh, I got this from my work. In office we use this for a testing for some sort of testing and we stopped it for about a year and a half ago and I just found this just a couple of days ago in office buried inside the cupboard and I wanted to basically get this take it home and set everything up I show it to you guys just a, a little uh, behind the scenes story no one couldn't remember password of this Mac mini account that was previously on this device so I had to reset it and me who installed so many versions of Windows on the machines, by far, the setting up this was the most absolutely headache for me. I never used the Mac. Installing the and resetting and setting up account, I had to press agree on so many terms and conditions. I just, I lost count. I mean, anything that I wanted to do, Apple was asking me, are you sure? Do you want to enter your password? Make sure your Apple ID, IE Cloud, and etc. I mean, I don't know how you people are using Macs. Anyway, stop me uh, ranting. Um, right, let's close that. Uh, later, don't remind me. Update Apple ID settings. I don't want this. As you can see, Samsung Dex already started because just wanted to save your time and mine. I already got the Samsung Dex installed. Let's actually raise a bit more. Samsung Dex already installed. Um, Installation process again it was an absolute nightmare. I, well, for me, it was a nightmare. Probably for you, it's just a simple thing. Download the software, install it, agree to terms and conditions, enter your password, agree to your terms and conditions that you entered your password, install it, make sure, agree to a terms and conditions that you installed about to run. Before you run, you need to restart, but for you to restart, you need to agree to terms and conditions and then enter your password. I mean, I mean, seriously, it's, it's I, I just gave up, but well, not give up. I just decided I need to do this and I just just had to do it and I'd done it, thank God. It took me about a couple of hours just to set everything up. Anyway, Samsung Dex is running on a Mac. Before I go, let me, how to check, oh yeah, go here, click here, about the Mac, that's how I get the uh, system information. So it's a Mac OS Catalina version 10.15.2. It's a Mac Mini late 2014 version, 1.4 dual core Intel i5 processor. Memory is six gigabytes, 1,600 megahertz DDR3. Uh, Intel HD graphics 5000 at 1536 megabytes built in. 
and the serial number is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, A, B, C, D, E. Dex, 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 Dex. So I do have my Note 9. Um, Dex on Windows and a Mac uh, originally was supported only on the S10, I think, or Note 10 phones. But gradually, uh, slowly, slowly, Samsung pushing the Android 10 version to S9 lineup phones. And they getting the Dex on Windows to Dex and Mac support as well. Uh, if you don't have that by now, there is a, I think, Android Authority post online where you can find your phone and you you will be you will find the roughly idea when you should receive the update. Because I joined the Samsung Dex Samsung members Android 10 um, beta program, I do have a beta Android 10 beta installed. I think it's beta. Probably it's already launched by now. You're watching this. It's going to be a final version launch. But anyway, this phone. As Note 9 do have Dex or Windows slash Mac feature activated. So I do have a HDMI C, uh, HDMI C, what I'm talking about, USB C hub, uh, USB cable connected to a Mac Mini. So let's do this. So plug that in. So that's charging, that's connecting. Okay. My phone is charging. It should give me a notification saying that Dex, something Dex is running. And now any second this should start showing me some sort of animations so let's put the phone here bingo animations happening my phone's telling me do you want to start casting decks i'm going to say start now and in a matter of seconds hopefully i will get the picture of my decks working on the mac mini and as you can see i do have samsung decks running on this mac mini pc and just by moving this window around i can see that it will perform quite well Obviously, a lot of people online, oh my god, so tight. A lot of videos that you're watching about Samsung DeX and Samsung DeX on Windows and uh, Samsung DeX on a Mac, everybody's copying files. So, yeah, why not? I'm just going to show you as well. I will go to internal storage. Let's get myself to documents. Uh, let's delete this file. Can I delete the file? Okay, come on. Yes. Yes, agree to this. I just want to delete the file, uh, move to a bin. So there is the uh, YouTube in imagery. So if I go here, there's a 12 megabytes file. I click and hold, drag, release here, and hopefully in a matter of seconds or so, it's appeared here. Ah, uh, you can see it. Here you go. It's there. Okay. Happy. Files can be copied. Anyway, the actual performance is quite good. Even, uh, well, it feels like I am actually running Dex on the just the food to on a separate monitor. But oh, I'm so tired. Um, let's do a bit of different things. So let's do a bit of gaming. So we're gonna go and we're gonna run the game. So let's open up the game launcher. And because I'm using Samsung Galaxy Tab S6 as a main device, this Note 9 has just a handful of games. But we're gonna go with Real Racing 3. I do have my Xbox controller already connected. Oh my god, I'm so tired. Right, we, we have the Xbox One controller connected, so we're gonna see how it's performing. Please note there is no sound. I'm not connected to sound. To be honest, I can't even bother going finding out how to get the sound. I just wanted to get this connected, demonstrate for you how it's working on this old uh, Mac Mini. So we're just gonna go uh, straight away into a start race. Oh no, no, this is a bit too much, too much for me. Uh, yes, 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 yes. Um, where's Kurt? Where's my hold on? Hold on, am I missing something here? Why, 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 uh, cloud ba save backup. You can't back up your saves because blah blah blah. Something okay. So let's find where is my race is. Okay, anyway, we're gonna do this F1 thing. Okay, download now. How much data I need to download? 21 megabytes additional from files needs to be downloaded for the game to run. That's fine. I can wait. Can you wait? You're going to wait? Thank you. Good. Come on. Bingo. So we're going to choose Red Bull because we want some wings. We want some wings. Confirm. I'm going to go for this. Uh, don't know what that is. I just clicked on something and agreed. Anyway, uh, enter. So we're going to go and race. Okay, where am I? Here you go, Mr. P. Right, so here we go. I'm playing Real Racing 3. 
running on the DeX on the Mac Mini 2014 version. So it's a six years old Mac Mini. It's working, the DeX performing very well, to be honest. Uh, graphics, I don't know. It looks a bit eh to from what I get, what, from what I used to see on, if I'm connecting, for example, my, my tablet on Note 9 directly to a TV, to a monitor. But this way, via the, via the um, Mac Mini, is performing quite well. Happy. I'm, I'm happy. Can, how to get out of this game? So if I go all the way up, we just close it and find. Let's go full screen, by the way. If I go full screen, that's what you get. You Obviously, if you're using ultra wide monitor, you will get black bars. But as you can see, with a 16 by 9 expert ratio monitors, Oh, so tired. 16 by 9 option, uh, 16 by 9 aspect ratio monitors that should work pretty well for your use. So, come on, how to get away now? Really? Here you go. Anyway, this is the uh, okay. So, Samsung Dex works fine. This, uh, this, the Mac Mini, um, 2014. 2014 uh, device. It does. It's. 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 Uh, by the way, I looked online on the Facebook Market and uh, other Craigslist type uh, website. <sighs> I'm so tired. Sorry about this video. If you're yawning as well. Uh, anyway, uh, and I can get. This is obviously gonna go back to my office and that working day. Unless I will think something else to do with this for you guys to demonstrate on the other video. But this will go back to office and I was looking online to get myself, for example, if I wanted to a second hand Mac Mini and I could get one for about 150 pounds. Second hand, uh, I think a bit newer version than this, but um, 2050, uh, 2150 pounds is great if you want to use this. And right, let's shut this down because I had enough of this Mac stuff. I want this Mac off my desk ASAP. Right. Okay. So I think I demonstrated everything for you guys. Let me know in the comment section below what you think about this video. Do you want me to try any other weird devices and see how they're performing with Dex on Windows? I do have, uh, or not do I have, but I might get myself, um, it's called Intel Compute Stick. Intel Compute Stick is a Windows 10 machine smaller than this keyboard. By the way, if you want to see this keyboard, I will leave a link to that video where I'm demonstrating this keyboard and this mouse, if I'll remember in the card up there or link in the description. So Intel Compute Stick is very small HDMI, uh, like a stick that is got uh, Windows 10 built in. So if you want to see that, let me know in the comment section below. And I'll see you next video. Thank you very much for staying with me. And I'll see you in the next next time. Okay, deal. Goodbye.